There is in, uh, in Namibia, for example, the number of Chinese people living here in the meantime is four times as much as, for example, the German uh, community. And in so far, it's not precisely the same what takes place all over the world. There are differences. And what I'm... Mr. Speaker, yeah. what is your problem with that? Why does it become your problem? <laughs> it, looks, it looks like it's a more European problem than our problem. Yeah. You are so sorry for us. <laughs> I don't see... Chinese will never come and play around here. As Germans don't be allowed to do that. Which Germans are doing, by the way. You talk about Chinese. We allow Germans to come offer visas here. Red carpet. Our people are harassed in Germany. Even diplomatic passport holders. In Germany. And you come in here, Germans come in here as they want. So why Chinese talk about Germans? How we are treating us there? Chinese don't treat us like that. Diplomatic passport holders. We're coming back from, from Geneva. These people were held up at the airport. Just now, last week, in Germany. We know what we will handle our own country. Don't be sorry for us. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah. Every time Westerner comes, it's about Chinese. <laughs> what is the problem? Is Namibia ever got no Chinese? Did you tell me, tell Namibia himself, Chinese have overtaken Namibia? Mm -hmm. Not in my, on my watch. Mm -hmm. I told Chinese ambassador, yeah, I'm not your puppet. It was in place everywhere. He so said, please, respect us. That's all I would say. It shows this respect that we are children who are going to be missed. Uh, Joel by Chinese or so? No. Chinese are coming in infrastructure they were all over Africa. And I saw in America, they are there. Who bailed Americans out from the financial crisis? Chinese money is there. So why uh, small Namibia who fought Germans, even Germans were fighting with you? We are tough people. Now Chinese will come and after our sovereignty come and decolonize us? You think so? Germans cannot succeed. Even those Germans who are here. So please. That every European coming is about Chinese. And Chinese were dealing with them. Then Germany. They come in Germany, then America. France, they bought up France. So Namibia is not bought up yet. So please, as I said, I told Chinese, then we are not going to exchange any the old colonial or imperialism or new imperialism. You're an African. The thing is that, as far as I'm concerned, since we met you people 500 years ago, look at us. We've given everything. You are still taking. It's true. I mean, where will the whole Western world be without, be without Africa? Our cocoa, our timber, our gold, our diamonds, our platinum, our whatever. Everything you are is us. I am not saying it, it's a fact. And, and in, in return for all of this, what have we got? Nothing. Anti-personnel indoctrination against ourselves. If you go and cook your horrible diseases like AIDS, you say it is us. You brought us tuberculosis. We didn't have this big cough until white people came here. In exchange for, in exchange for Africa giving Europe 500 solid years of our people, I mean, not Europe, the Western world, of our human beings to work your canes, to dig your gold, to take in gold itself, diamond, I mean, you know, fish, peanuts, palm oil, everything. In exchange for that, we have got nothing, nothing, and you know it, nothing. And you look upon, you know, so white folks look upon us like monkeys. It is true. It's in your literature. Hey, you know, some of your best thinkers have said this about us. Have you heard of the, I mean, all these Germans, 
Have you heard? Okay. Yes. <clears throat> they said Lord Burton, yes. people like that. They said we 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 don't even have the brain of of animals. That's what we've got from you people. But don't you think that this is over now? Over where? Is it over? Who said that eight came from the green monkey? Is it over? Is it over? Well, if this is your impression, do you think that you can ever forgive us? It's not a question of forgiveness. I have nothing against you. My point is that you did and you are doing for your survival what is necessary. We can't blame you for that. The fact that we are not, we didn't do enough for our own survival and we are still not doing enough for your survi our survival. That is not your problem. You know, even, the, even everybody that God has created has a sense of survival. You know, and until we, if we don't develop it, we can't blame white people. You came here because you needed these things. You took gunpowder from the Chinese. You needed them to shoot people.